Caro can defense, advance, tall variation. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. In the Karo Khan defense, the pawns on d7 and d5 can be quickly pushed to take control of the center and engage the e4 pawn. The d4 square seizes the center and launches an assault on the e5 and c5 squares. The pawn on e4 is under attack from the center, where d5. e5 closes the center and controls the important d6 and f6 squares. Bf5 develops the bishop where it controls the important e4 square, black can play e7 e6 next, without trapping the light squared bishop on c8. h4 gains space on the king side and controls the g5 square. This offers an equal trade of pieces. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Backs off. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is the final book action. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This misses a chance to threaten a queen and gain a tempo. It is incorrect. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to suggest winning a queen. It is incorrect. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. That's good. The queen is therefore moved to safety. It is ideal. This prevents an assault on a pawn that may have been taken. That's good. This secures a pawn. It is ideal. This disregards an improved method of recovering a component. It is incorrect. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is incorrect. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. By assaulting the opposing queen, this activates a piece while also buying time. It is ideal. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. The pawn is now suitably protected. That's good. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. That is a regrettable error. It is incorrect. That falls flat. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to threaten a rook and gain tempo. It is incorrect. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. This misses a great but hard to find move. It is incorrect. A wise decision. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This misses a better way to win a tempo by threatening a rook. This allows the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This misses a great but hard to find move. There was only one good move there. This misses an opportunity to create a passed pawn. It is a miss. Although the game was nearly tied, white is now in a losing position. It falls flat. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This took advantage of a mistake and black now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. 
this misses a chance to seize a queen that was in danger of seizing material. It is incorrect. This is the only good move. It is a great move. It's all right. That's good. This seizes a helpless pawn. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. That's good. Recaptures. It is ideal. A chance to advance a passed pawn towards promotion is lost in this. It is incorrect. This requires an outpost, a square that is currently in play where a pawn cannot push the knight off. It is ideal. By doing this, a chance to advance a defeated piece is missed. It is incorrect. This wins material. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a bad move and white is no longer in a losing position. This threatens to win a rook. It is a great move. Now that the rook is on an open file, it is easier to control squares all over the board. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to win material. It is a miss. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. This is the only move that works. This was a game-changing move, giving black a winning position. It is a great move. This divides up parts by launching multiple attacks at once. This poses a checkmate threat. It is ideal. This loses a queen. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses a better way to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a blunder. This is the way to win a queen. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. Backs off. That's good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It's compelled. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten checkmate. This permits the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This requires an open file, a typical technique for rook activation. It is ideal. This threatens to play checkmate. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even.